Well, welcome back to First at Four. We are taking a look at the seven day forecast here, which does include some better rainfall chances over the next few days, especially Thursday and Friday, and then possibly again for portions of our weekend. So we could use some rain relief for sure, as things have been very hot and continue to be hot even through uh, most of this next seven day forecast. So I do want to take some time to remind you of some tips to look for when we're talking about signs of heat exhaustion and heat stroke. Uh, of course, with heat exhaustion, you're looking for more of that faint or dizzy feeling in someone's head, excessive sweating, cool and pale and clammy skin. As far as a heat stroke, it's a throbbing headache, no sweating, so quite the opposite here in red, hot, dry skin. Also a rapid, strong pulse and loss of consciousness. Uh, definitely want to go ahead and contact 911 and get that person to the hospital as quick as possible uh, and help them cool that body temperature down. But temperatures do stay really dangerously hot even through the weekend with the heat index, so just remember to limit your time outdoors. A recent survey